Right now is the best time to be a watch collector because watches like these are delivering exceptional value for money. Hello there, my name is Kieran. Welcome to Top Tier Ticker. I hope you're having a good day. Today, we'll be taking a look at the top 10 hottest affordable watches right now. Most of these are brand new releases, fresh off the press. And the last one today, well, that's the freshest of them all. If you enjoyed this video at any point, please consider dropping a like rating. And you might as well subscribe while you're down there for more top 10s like this. I'll leave links to every watch that I mentioned in the description below. Let's do this. If you want a GMT watch that's bursting with character, Seiko might have just made your next watch. They recently released three absolutely fire GMTs that were so red hot they almost burnt my hands. These three new models are basically new colour variants of the mega popular SSK range. And if you're a big fan of Rolex GMTs, you'll also likely enjoy these new Seikos because of the colourways chosen. We have a brand new green variant that I'm sure people will nickname the Hulk, a two-tone variant that's awfully similar to the Root Beer, and my favourite, this white and electric blue model that I nicknamed the Blue Polar. The dial on this piece is like a freshly frozen sheet of ice, with one of the most vibrant blue GMT hands I've ever seen. The two-tone is my next favourite, with a golden bezel and gold accents throughout the dial. There is a hint of brown here within the dial and the bezel, so you do get that Root Beer feel with this one. Now the green one is actually my least favourite of the three. It's a bit more subdued than the rest of the lineup, which does make the watch feel a bit more sophisticated if that's what you're after. You can expect the usual Seiko flaws, so mineral glass, pressed clasp, no screw down crown, but you get that iconic Seiko shape and brand name on the dial. And as usual with Seiko, a great watch for the price. I've pretty much only had one dress watch in my collection this year. 